Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited to share something brand new with you guys. A lot of the wig and topper wearers, they often want to pull their hair up and they're not quite sure how, especially if they have total hair loss, a lot of hair loss in the back, they're just very thin and sparse. Um, I've shared ways that you can wear a wig in an updo and a topper in an updo, which is fantastic, but sometimes for that seamless look, there's other things that you can do, and I'm going to show you something today from a company, a gal, who creates a lot of beautiful, beautiful custom pieces. Her name is Tawny, and she is the hair mama. Look at that cute package. Isn't it adorable? So cute. And what I'm going to share with you guys today is her super awesome pony wig. First of all, I want to talk about her beautiful packaging. I love the packaging. When I opened up the package, it was all wrapped together beautifully with hot pink tissue paper, super cute stickers. Everything was so cute, so well put together, and it set a great first impression. So awesome job, Tawny. I love the packaging. It's awesome. Now, a lot of what Tawny offers is beautifully custom colored hair pieces and wigs. It's all very high quality human hair, uh, just gorgeous. Today, I'm going to be sharing a red, a gorgeous red pony wig. I love this shape. When she mentioned this shape to me, I had recently tried a wig that was red, and this this red, it's almost like a, a auburn color, but, but red. Oh my goodness, it's so rich and beautiful. Her pony wigs often have a bang that she has included on it. I was really excited when I found out that Tawny was starting her own business because I feel like she has an eye for beautiful hair. She's tried it all, and so because of that, I feel like she knew what she wanted to carry in her own line, and it was probably going to be the most high-quality, top-notch stuff out there. As far as fantastic human hair and high quality, because that's what she wears, and that's what she's going to offer the people who purchase from her. Not only that, she's really, really talented with hair color. So what you get is the most customized, beautiful hair pieces and wigs, just like you would be taking your own bio hair to a hair salon and receiving those customized, beautiful, trendy, and very in hairstyles and colors. This is 20 inches and it's European hair. This has been customized and thinned and layered. This particular pony wig is light density, and I really like the density on this wig because for pulling up into updos and buns and ponytails, it's a fantastic density for that so it doesn't sag or hang, and you will understand what I'm talking about when I put it on. I'm an average size head in most wig brands, so we decided to go with a medium sized cap because there can be a tendency for it to stretch over time and we want these pony wigs to stay nice and snug. However, they do have adjustable straps so you can utilize those to tighten or loosen so that it fits your head more true to size. I'm just going to let you guys know each pony wig comes with a wig grip like this and a really cute headband. Look how adorable this is. And the fabric is really soft. I'm gonna have to get in touch with Tawny because I really like this headband. It's super cute on the wig and I would love to have this type of headband in more colors. The cute thing about it too is this little bow up here has wire in it so it's you can move it around and have it sit the way that you want to. It's not just floppy because of that nice wire inside the bow. These pony wigs do need a headband. The reason why is because you have just more of like a blunt raw edge, as you can see here. And also there was a bang added to this pony wig. If you are not one that wants a bang, I know that that can be customized to fit your needs. These pony wigs are ideal for updos, top knots, ponytails, anything that you wanna pull up and off the neck, this is ideal and it's the way that the cap is formed. 
I had some people asking me when I posted a photo on Instagram, wait, how does the back work? How does this work? Is it like a wig that you pull up? Yes, it's a wig, but the way that they have created this cap, the hair is meant to be pulled up with a traditional wig that you're trying to pull up in an updo. Typically, those wigs have wefts that go downwards, where with the pony wig, the way that they have positioned the hair on the cap, it moves in a way upwards, just like your hair would do naturally. You can do a side pony, you can do a braid, but it is mostly meant to be worn up. And you'll see that when I put it on. So I'm gonna show you guys the inside of the cap and give you more of an idea of what I mean. What I love about this is you have these combs that you can slide under the wig grip for additional security. It's very comfortable. It's just this nice cap that's, um, you know, you don't feel the wefts or anything in there. Uh, it's nice and secure. The hair is gorgeous. You see her cute little tag right there. I love all the details that she has included in her line. I put this cute, cute wig on the other day. I'll show you guys a picture. Isn't it cute? I was impressed right from the start with it right out of the box, just adorable. And for the most part, any kind of headband like this, a full headband, or I did wear it with this headband as well, it will hide that rim of your wig. If you did want to purchase a wig that was close to your bio hair color, you could utilize the perimeter of your bio hair if you felt like you really wanted to make it look extremely realistic. Since the red does not match my bio hair, and there might be a time that I want to utilize some bio hair, I actually had some auburn fibers on hand, and I'm going to experiment and kind of just fill in my hair with some auburn hair fibers so that you know, I'm covered as far as the color goes and my bio hair will blend with it better if I choose to incorporate it at all. So I'm just going to add those right now before I even put this wig on. So the sides of my hair look a little bit more auburn. So if I do happen to incorporate my hair, it will match this beautiful shade of red just a little bit better. I'm not too familiar with wig grips. I often wear wig liners, but uh, the wig grip is great and it also is fantastic to slide these nice combs in for extra security. Now, if you have no hair or very little hair, Tawny let me know that she actually can create a pony wig with more of a medical type grade cap. So keep that in mind. There are options whether you have a little hair, a lot of hair, or no hair at all. I'm going to show you what my bio hair looks like without any type of alternative hair at all. This is my ponytail, guys. This is why I love alternative hair. I just have never had the most thickest, fullest head of hair. What do you guys think about my pony? It's like a baby pony. Pretty. You like it? My, my little girl thinks it's great. So I've straightened my hair a little bit, but a lot of times my hair looks pretty dang nappy. And the nice thing with this pony wig is it doesn't matter what your bio hair looks like. You pull this up and this, this beautiful hair color, this gorgeous European hair, that's all you see. So now I'm going to put on the wig grip. going to make sure my bio hair is nice and secure. I'm going to turn the wig slightly inside out. Take that comb and I will slide it into my hair and underneath that wig grip. And I'm going to make sure that that hairline matches where my hairline is, my natural hairline. And then I'll take the bottom comb and I will slide it up and underneath the wig grip on the underside. Then what you do from that point on is adjust the wig, make sure everything's tucked in nicely. With it not pulled up and with it looking like this, it, it really does look a little undone, but this isn't the way that this wig is supposed to be worn. 
I actually trimmed the bang on this cute wig so that I could wear her side swept if I wanted because I do love that side swept look but I also wanted to be able to wear it front facing as well pulling it up the possibilities are endless and a simple ponytail is adorable everybody who wears wigs gets into the dilemma of saying how the heck do I wear my hair up how do I get away with you know the the wefts of a wig and pulling it up and having it look natural well doing this it's like a no-brainer it's meant to work this way it's meant to travel upwards so it's nice and smooth and I love the density of this wig it's the the light density of this wig is perfect it feels nice and thick but it's not so thick that it you have this weighed down ponytail I'm just gonna show you guys how simple it is to give yourself the cutest ponytail lickety split No special styling skills here, guys. It's just a ponytail. And you can make that ponytail super high like this. You can make it, you know, lower. You can make a side ponytail like you're from the 80s. You can make it just right in the middle of your head right here. With this pony wig, the pony can be placed wherever you like. So we still look a little undone with this seam right here. So you'll take your cute headband that comes with the pony wig, or you can go ahead and get more headbands at your favorite store. I have a few, but the trick is to get a headband that will fully cover all the way around. So something like this would work. So let's put that on and I'll show you how adorable it is. I kept the sides of the bang long so that I could tuck it, especially when I don't want to show any trace of my own bio hair. This really helps to hide anything. And I just think it's very flattering because it frames the face or whatnot. So that rim is fully covered, even in the back, as you see. People wanted a back view. This is what it looks like. Nice and smooth. You don't see a seam. You can change out those headbands. You could wear more of a simple gym type headband. If you wanted to wear a wig like this to the gym, you could get more something fancy. I think that this headband could be dressed down or up. You could also use a cute scarf. That would work. There's just a lot of possibilities on what you can utilize to cover that rim. Another thing that I think would be adorable is to do some type of cute bun. Seriously, buns. You cannot go wrong with buns. If you don't want to do a bun, there's a lot of other possibilities as far as styles you can wear up. Go look them up on Pinterest. Look it up on Instagram. There's so many things you could do with this cute wig. It's unbelievable. Honestly, my favorite is the pony. There's even versatility with ponies. Even if you just wanted to go from more of your straight look to your ringletty look. Look at those cute curls. I love that it's human hair, that it's heat friendly, that you can style it how you want. Let's take that out and try an updo.
Look at that. What do you guys think? So freaking adorable. I love it. Oh my goodness. Let's try another headband. So I had this one on hand. It's actually quite old. It fits around and Velcros at the back and it happened to cover the rim nicely. I also used that the other day. I think it's adorable with it. Let's have a front bang like so and do more of a messy bun. This would be fantastic for swimming. If you're unsure of what to do when you swim, you could definitely put this on, grab more of a sporty type of headband and take her in the water. Why not, right? And there you have it with your messy bun. What do you guys think? I love this color, number one. I'm just a fan of reds, but I love the versatility of this wig. I love that it's up and off my neck. I love that there's so many styling options. I love that it's beautiful European Remy hair. It's just amazing. I'm so grateful for the opportunity to share this with you guys because I think that it can help a lot of women out. If you guys use the code HAIRMAMA25, you can receive $25 off of your first purchase of any custom wig or topper. Just visit thehairmama.com. Now I'm actually going to do more of a side swept. I'm going to throw back on this adorable, adorable headband. Side lower ponytail. Seriously, I just can't keep playing. What do you guys think? This wig feels very comfortable and very secure. Feels so good. I could probably go to sleep in it, really. Anyway, you guys, seriously, check out thehairmama.com. Utilize that $25 off coupon code. I'll have all the links down below. She is also on Instagram, and I'll have all those links down below as well. I'm going to have a blast coming up with fun styles. All right, you guys, that's all. If you have any questions, be sure to comment below. You can email me. Of course, you guys can contact Tawny with the Hair Mama and she will help you out with any of your questions. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I will see you next time. Bye.